Good morning and welcome to Barcelona. We've had a fantastic couple of days here, but it's now time for cruise day. It's embarkation day. Four Bs, are you ready? Yeah. Where are we heading on? So, yes, we are. We're already in Barcelona, so we're going to do an embarkation day. So come and join us as we head on another cruise. Four Bs heading on MSC Sea View. Woo! Adios! So we're set at the bus stop. Our unconventional way of arriving down at the cruise port is we're going on an open top bus. We've got a two day ticket we got yesterday. So me being a tight thing, we're gonna use it and we're gonna go on an open top bus with all of our cases. More transport, are you excited for more transport? Yes. Mum, are you excited for more transport? Uh, wait. We do love transport. So, <laughs> come and join us as we go with all of our cases on an open top bus to embark Embassy Sea View. the cruise bus. Cruise bus departs from the roundabout just along from the Christopher Columbus statue. Three euros one way, 450 for return. Let's check out the route. see it was a busy day in ports there is five terminals along this pier and the cruise bus does service all five on a busy day like this there is staff on hand to tell you which bus is going to which terminal or just ask the driver we found it efficient and definitely will be using the cruise bus again if you've liked and subscribed to the channel then we do thank you if you haven't it's completely free and it really does help us out Aha, MSC Sea View. Why First queue outside was for your luggage to be taken away and also to check your COVID pass. The line went quickly, it was all very simple. Then it was into the air conditioned terminal. Once again, the line went very quick, it was very efficient. Hola, buenas. After check-in was complete, it was boarding time and you had to go through a shop. My worst nightmare, Ernest wanted the whole shop. Alice, embarkation is done. Yeah, Are you ready to board the cruise ship? Yeah, we're on the escalator though. I know, on the escalator, heading up to Embassy Sea View. Are you ready to start the cruise? Yeah. Ooh, exciting time. So, we've we'll just done check-in. That was actually alright, wasn't it? It's quite easy, about half an hour we've just spent and no. we're about to head that was like 10 minutes. about 10 minutes and now we're ready to head on to Embassy Sea View.
after we boarded, it was straight up to the buffet. Let's check out what food was on offer for lunch. Seaview. How was embarkation at Monty? It was really, really quick actually. Um, yeah, about oh. half an hour from Kew to getting on board. Yes, yeah, so we. No, it was quicker than now, like 20 minutes. No, I reckon it was about 20 minutes. But we got the, as you saw, we got the open top bus. Never want to miss a day. We had a two day ticket, so we got the open top bus. And then we connected with the cruise bus, which was five, wasn't it? How much was that? About 10 for four of us? Uh, 12 euros. So euros. Just a tip, if you are going to do that and you've got a um, tour, then don't get off at the Columbus Monument, get off at the next stop. Yeah. Because we had to lug all the suitcases. But I think it's 4 54 um, return, so if, if you're visiting just Barcelona on a cruise for the day, um, it's quite a good value and it, and it takes you right down into the, to the front there, the Columbus statue, but we just did it one way. And then there was a little bit of a queue, but it was, it was really well organised, actually, really, really well organised, wasn't it? We, uh, first desk, drop your bags off, through security, a little bit of a queue, and then, and then we're on. And then, but then, what happened once we've arrived? Now, we have been told about this with MSC, we didn't get it with Virtuosa, but what happened when we got on? It, it was like, you know, in the summer, when you put a sweet drink down and all the wasps come to it, it was a bit like that. We were absolutely bombarded but I think we had about 10 people coming up for us, an upgrade for um, the restaurants. So we've, we've had, so literally, yeah, so four or five when we got on. The lady wasn't impressed that Rachel didn't want a photo, did she? Um, even though we're not going to do the package, so we didn't. We've already got the top drink package, so we had to explain that. And then we had to... Um, and then we kept on being offered the food as well, um, which we've already got. Um, but yeah, you literally, people were coming out from everywhere, weren't they? Lifts, they were just, uh, doing yeah. The, yeah. And we just had the buffet, which was excellent, wasn't it? Do you know what? If the food continues to be like that, it's very impressed. It was much better than Virtuosa. Loads of choice, um, loads of fresh salads, fruits. Yeah, yeah, very, very, very good, very good. It would just be nice if they gave you a welcome on board welcome <laughs> rather than a, um, do you want the drinks package? Do you want the beer? Even in the buffet, it must have been about four times someone asked us as well. So, But anyway, the ship looks really good. We can't wait to discover it. We're about to go, our room's ready shortly, isn't it? Yeah. So we're about to go in there, then probably to the aqua park, and we've got a week on as we go all around the Mediterranean. The kids are having fun. They are currently doing back massages. How's the back massages going? We don't know whether they're charging for this, but are we going to get one, do you reckon? I have been offered, so I might, um, yeah. I might take them up on it. We've got a lovely view of Barcelona to take a look at. There we go, look. There's our view of Barcelona. So we will chill as we wait for our cabin to be ready. from the four bees <laughs> hello what are you up to so on all msc ships you have these boards floating around yeah so you can reserve and you can book activities oh as you can see so you've got to do the compulsory drill that one looks fun can we go to that musical game labyrinth oh fit dance, dance. body combat i wonder if you have to that's the same time as the... Oh, that looks good. Could you show us some other things? What if I wanted to book a show? So, I've already just booked the show, but... No, no, pretend it for the want. camera, we're not. Yeah, but I'm just going to show you. Oh, right, okay. So, you go to plan and book. Yeah, that looks good. Shows. Oh, I like to see Dancing Queen. 
I don't, but we'll go with it. And, mm. oh, right. And then, no. yeah, you just go to reserve and you click your card to say who you are. You can also, oh. this is quite cool. If you forget where your cabin is. Oh, yes. Your cabin. Right. Scan your card. Yeah. And then it will show you. So we are staying in 10 2 2 2 2. Thank you very much, Rachel. You're welcome. Hope you have a good cruise. Thanks. Oh, it's big. Oh, it's big. Right. It's very big. It's massive. Oh, wow. It feels bigger than the other than the much It is massive, isn't it? This is the bathroom. <laughs> Which one of these pretty indoors is the bathroom? Um, that, I'm guessing, is a... Uh, Time to head to the pool. Time to sail away. Cheers. Cheers. Enjoy the sail away from Barcelona. by the microphone so we are sailing away from Barcelona did you enjoy that sail away that was a cool sail away what uh, ship did we get to see um Royal Caribbean was it Anthem of the Seas it was wasn't it uh, Anthem of the Seas and the smiley face one Ada as and well. we also saw um we also saw uh, what was it well, yeah, was Viking. A, there was a cargo ship Viking as well we did see Viking so if you're in any of those ships on the 29th of July, then take a look here because we did a little video for uh, our sail away. That was a beautiful sail away. Now out to sea, aren't we? What's been your highlight of your day so far, Alice? I don't know. You don't know? Rachel, what's been your highlight of your day so far? Um, sail away? Yeah, sail away. We've all got pink ones. It was a lovely sail away. We're matching in pink. We are all matching with pink. We've only got pink. And uh, we did have a nice time around the pool. There was a bit of a dancing uh, examination. Now, now we did want to change our meal time, so we had six o'clock, didn't we? And normally you can just sort of go down there and say, "Look, can I change my meal times?" And if they've got space, they'll have. I was in a queue of about six or seven people all from different countries so the guy was very good he did speak very different languages but every time he spoke to them he was very very animated and i think everybody in the queue wanted the same thing they all wanted to change their time to eight o'clock and i got the feeling that we weren't going to get eight o'clock because every single time he was going very irate right with everybody he was writing things down everyone was leaving disappointed so when I got to the front, I was a bit nervous, I must say, this guy was a bit frightening, and I did say, can I have eight o'clock rather than 6.15? He wrote my number down and said, maybe in a couple of days, but he was a bit more direct with that. Maybe in a couple of days? So I fully understand it, yeah, because... Yeah, because on and off. Yeah, because on MSC, everyone gets on and off on different uh, ports. So if you go from Southampton, obviously, if you go from the UK, normally everybody on board stays on for the whole week, the two weeks, MSC, it's on, off, on, off. So anyway, yeah, so we're not going to get a spot. Can I just, um, just while you're talking, so from here, I could see every single corner cabin has got a bar on the balcony. They have, yeah. I think it's a hot tub, isn't it? Can you also let us know in the comments if you've ever had one of those suites? Have it's you very ever, cool. Have you ever had a bath on your, I think it's a hot tub, but yeah, it's very cool, isn't it? I would show it, but I don't really want to show someone else's cabin, really. But yeah, so it's very cool. Some of them do have, uh, we've got a really massive room. We will show you on the room tour, but it's a standard balcony, but it seems a lot bigger. 
So anyway, we're off to the buffet tonight. We've had a really good uh, day. So hopefully we do get 8 o'clock. If not, we'll have to stick with 6.15. But always do ask, because normally you do get the 6.15. You normally can, can change. But they're obviously really, really busy this week, 8 o'clock. But beware, if you want to take on the man from Seaview, the maitre d', he was a frightening guy. I, I was very nervous. Alice, your highlight? You're going to go to Kids Club tomorrow? Why well, can't you make a Spanish friend? There are British people on here. Yeah, Italian. Yeah, yeah that's a good thing. Broaden your horizons, Alice. Broaden your horizons and make some new uh, friends. So we're going to enjoy some of this scenery on CV and then we're going to head to the buffet and we'll show you a little bit of what we had on uh, the buffet. And then we've got ABBA. Alice, sing us an ABBA song. I don't know any ABBA song. Let me sing, you, sing us an ABBA song. No, I refuse to sing Abba songs. Okay, I'll do. Abba? What's Abba? Abba Mamma Mia. Oh, Mamma Mia. Oh. Here we go again. Mamma. Mamma Mia. Mama. Anyway, on that note, we'll see you down in the buffet and maybe some Abba later. Later. That's okay, yeah. That should be good. We'll, we'll go up. Yes. Then it'd be good for our TikTok. And then we can yeah, go up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah for sure. Wow. In Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. Yeah. They like that old man doing TikToks. show was excellent a really good way to start the cruise some great voices on stage <laughs> then it was to the lounge for some live music an intense game of cards I think I was the winner. A brilliant dance competition to watch. And then I think it was the Italian version of the Birdie song. I obviously was filming and not joining in.
So day one is complete. Monty, have you had a good evening? Yeah, it's been really good. Yes, I really like the buffet. So obviously earlier one we couldn't change our booking. So we had to go into the buffet. And actually, I would make a statement here. There is the best buffet that in the evening that I have had. Yeah, so on our previous video, when we spoke about um, MSC Virtuosa and I was a bit harsh about the food, actually, the buffet for lunch and dinner this evening, there was loads of choice and um, really, really tasty food. Yeah, really, really good. Really, really good. Yeah, and also normally we like to have a sit-down meal in the evening. Mm. So we don't normally have buffet, but we had an amazing, and we saw earlier, and we'll show a little clip now, amazing sunset, didn't we, as well? Yeah, it's beautiful. We were yeah. out, it was lovely temperatures, so it was all good. Um, so yeah, excellent choice, well done. So let's hope that continues with the buffet. And then we saw ABBA. You're not a fan of ABBA, but you enjoyed the show, didn't you? I did. I just got to tell you something. What? Just while we're filming, you need to look at the green dot. There it is. I'm looking now. <laughs> <laughs> and um, yeah, I'm not a fan of Alba, but actually, it was really good. And um, the two female singers were absolutely amazing. Yeah. Um, so it kind of took away from the awful outfits and. And the else. audience was really into it as well. Yeah, the audience seemed, really seems to be into. Uh, I've noticed that on the ship, everyone seems to be really up for it and really good. And then we've had. Yeah, it's really really lively. Yeah, we've just come, you know what, I've just seen a clip there. We've just come, this is quarter past midnight and the atrium is just like buzzing, isn't it? Yeah, it's really, crazy. really, really, really lively. Everyone's loving it. We've just come from the bar, we had a game of cards and they had a dancing competition, which was good. Yeah, it was very Yeah, good. really fun. Yeah, Should really good fun. dancing. I love it when you go on a cruise, one of my favorite things is watching all the, and this is not meant to be derogatory or rude, but older couples that really know how to dance and that they're doing like the cha-cha, the salsa, and just amazing. Um, so yeah, that was really good to watch. Yeah, it was really, really good to watch. Yeah, really good, out. on board is a really good atmosphere. Good mix of Spanish, Italians, uh, a few English, so it's, yeah. Yeah. A lovely, lovely evening, lovely first day. So we're cruising along, it's Marseille tomorrow. Now we're going to Marseille twice next year, aren't we? Mm -hmm. And we were hoping to pop off and do a bit of wandering around in the afternoon but we had a letter today that said that it was uh, about 50 euros for all of us to get the bus it takes about 45 minutes um so it's not worth us getting a bus for a, for a couple of hours for 50 euros so we're going to discover the ship instead and we'll discover marseille next year sound good yeah sounds good yeah so we have had an excellent night thanks for joining us keep liking and subscribing if you would like more content we've got loads of great content on the way from msc seaview <laughs> <laughs> you nearly said virtuosa i did i did i'm used to saying virtuosa um we did a little video which you can see sort of that way um of our sail away from barcelona so check that out and we'll see you on day two of our msc seaview vlog series there's the green, there's the green. I keep looking Tom's at that. Tom's had a few runs. Yeah. <laughs> it's time for bed. Laters. Bye. Next time, it's fun. Food. Familiar faces. Fantastic views. Food in hot, hot, hot. And fabulous voices. Thank you for subscribing. Please do like this video if you've enjoyed it. Tap on the video if you want to see our travel day. And we'll see you real soon on Cruising with the Four Bees.